Hi guys, it is July 14, 2013. First, I want to say, oh my god, thank you. you. The comments below my video that I posted yesterday were amazing. Amazing. I mean, I couldn't believe. It was truly... Uh, what really shocked me was how many people, how many people are having to deal with their crazy families uh, families, and how many people are actually suffering the consequences of their very sick families. This is insane. This is utterly insane. And as far as I'm concerned, the reason why it's taking place is because we don't hold anybody accountable and they think that they can get away with anything. This has to stop. This really has to stop. I got so many comments, but I got so many private messages as well from people. And it is truly just, it, it will never ever cease to amaze me how people can think that they can treat people like garbage and get away with it. I don't like it. I'll be putting up another video addressing this in particular in the comments and everything, but wow, I, I cannot tell you how great you guys are. I, I'm re I was reading those comments and I'm thinking, I, I, I have the best subscribers. Uh-uh, no one else. I have the best subscribers. All right. So I thought I would start today with a little bit of an uplift. But let me preface what I'm going to read with saying that I haven't found the study. Um, one of my subscribers, Kevin, and then a number. Kevin, is it 905? I think. Thank you, Kevin, for sending me th this. I... <laughs> because it sure was an upread for me, that's for sure. Um, but I tried looking for the study, the actual study. I don't like reading other people's interpretations of studies. I like to read the actual study and then read articles about, unless, you know, I know the author and I, you know, throughout time I have... Um, felt that their interpretations of studies is right on, you know, unbiased. So if I don't have the study and I'm just reading articles, I'm not sure what it is I'm reading. Am I reading the actual unbiased interpretation or am I reading the author's filtered interpretation based on their own experience? But because it was so uplifting, I'm going to read it to you. And if anybody can find this study, then please bring it to my attention because I would really love to read it. Um, but I'm just, I'm not going to read the whole thing. I'm just going to jump to the actual study. A newly released, uh, because a lot of this was, you know, the author's comments and everything. And I'll link below so you can read it if you're interested in that. Um, and I'm not saying it's not interesting, but I'm just going to jump to what he was talking about with the actual study. A newly released study by psychologists and social scientists in both the United States and the UK is bound to shock the world, for it has found that those who believe in conspiracy theories are considered more sane than those who believe in the official versions of the contested events. For most before it news readers, this is simply not shocking in the least bit. In fact, it is quite common knowledge. For Americans who still believe the accepted versions of stated events, it's quite possible that they will continue to stay insane and hostile. In fact, those now believing the conspiracy theory version of events now outnumber those believing the status propaganda. Two to one. Wow. Wow. And of course, we know that history repeats itself. It happened in China, it happened in Germany. Anyone who thinks it can't happen in America is half asleep. What's left of the Constitution is in the process of being destroyed. Americans are quickly awakening to hidden truths. Is it too late? Who knows? But it sure would explain why the powers to be are so eager to crack down on Americans. Anyway, I'm going to link below because I want to get to another article that was just posted in Global Research. Um, very interesting about geoengineering. Thank you again.
everybody, thank you so much. Have a great day.